I'm Dr. Matt Chalmers, and uh, I want to answer one of the questions we get all the time is people ask when they bring their kids in, you know, hey, we have ADD or this or that, and they ask, what exactly is it? What causes ADD? The, there are several different theories. The biggest one that I subscribe to is it's a shutdown of the reticular formation in the brain, which is what keeps the brain awake and keeps it actually focused on specific tasks. Uh, the easiest way for me to illustrate that it's a it's an issue of basically the brain falling asleep due to lack of adrenaline that it is a dysfunction in the brain's genetic makeup that you just oh sorry you can never get that back is if you take a child who's diagnosed ADD oh they can't sit and read their book they can't sit and write they have ADD they have to be on all these medications which are basically very powerful stimulants if you take these children you put them from a video game with high frame rate refresh and lots of action, lots of things going on, and they can sit for two or three or even four hours, pay attention, follow the game, get through things, and those sort of things. Basically, pay attention to something that's fast moving, has a lot of action, lots of flashy colors going on. That's gonna show that they don't have a problem paying attention, that they have something that's actually causing the brain to more or less fall asleep, phase out, that type of thing. So that's also why when you give these kids extremely powerful stimulants <clears throat> that make their adrenals produce more adrenaline, it actually keeps the brain awake. So that's generally what we see it as, is a, is a failure of the reticular formation to stay awake, process, and function. And that's generally due to a lack of adrenaline, which is, at the end of the day, generally going to be a gut issue um, and a nutrition issue.